Hi everybody, it is One Control Wednesday. I am Jay Leonard J. What do I have on the bench today? I got the Baby Blue Overdrive. Let's hear what it sounds like. <laughs> Well, as I said, it is One Control Wednesday, and what I have on the bench today, oh my gosh, is the Baby Blue Overdrive. Now, if the term Baby Blue Overdrive sounds familiar, well, then that must probably mean, you know, of Bjorn Yule and BJFE effects. Uh, that was probably the first pedal he uh, produced to call the Baby Blue Overdrive. And now that Bjorn Yule's hanging out with the One Control Boys, they decided to reshoot in this nice little package right over here. A lot more affordable and sounds, ooh, just as good. It's delicious in tone, has a nice, uh, great range of overdrive tones, and it has that little bit of fuzz pedal gobby fizz and mm on the top. It's really, really pretty. I think you guys will like it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get this little unit over here and we're gonna plug it into a Fender Telecaster with Virgil Arlo pickups and string joy strings led right into my old Fender Deluxe amplifier, okay? So let's get this thing on and hear what it sounds like. <laughs> All right, so let's get to work. This is my clean tone. Here we go. Oh, I know that song. Let's go down low gain, uh, and we're gonna add a little bit of treble. That's what we got. some guts right over there. Uh, it really came alive, nice and expressive. Let's go to that bridge pickup. Uh, what's great about this low gain sound is you pretty much just put it on, you get that nice edgy with a little bit of dirtiness on the top tone. Oh, it's just a lot of fun to play with. <laughs> Let's go move up the gain a little bit. Let's go see this range. There it is, right before it gets too saturated. You'll notice as we get higher in gain too, it gets a little bit edgier, more compressed. Uh, you could just back off the treble a little bit. Aggressive, like, mmm, anti. Oh, that's just delish. S. Uh, what you can do with this is you could just pretty much ride this thing exactly right around noon. I find that's kind of the sweet spot. Push it up a little bit more if you want just a little bit more sustain. Crunch it down a little bit if you just want to get a little bit more of that cleanness coming through. No matter where you put it, you're gonna be pretty darn happy about it. Yeah. 
This is a very, very dynamic pedal. Once you get up to the top end, it actually starts getting almost like a fuzz kind of thing. <laughs> Here's this, the volume all the way down to three. Let's roll it up. Within this pedal, you pretty much have a, a, a like an overdrive, and then you have like a fuzz pedal on the top. Just act extreme versatility. It's it's actually a lot of fun. Or you could just crank everything up and rock out. I'll be happy with that too. <laughs> That is it, that is the video. As I said, on the first Wednesday of every month, boom, One Control Wednesday, we talk about a different One Control pedal or a group of pedals, so keep your eyes open for that. Please keep commenting, please keep subscribing, and also, uh, if you guys have been watching the page a lot, I've been posting a lot of videos from the Toman Gearhead University, and if you don't know what that is, check out the previous videos, and there's gonna be a lot more. I still have like a big, cartload of videos that I still have yet to post from Toman and I'll be slowly throwing them out throughout, I don't know, as much as I want. <laughs> I just keep, keep bringing them out. Uh, so hopefully you guys keep watching that. That being said, I will see you all soon. Take care and goodbye.